the puppies are about oh almost five and a half weeks old they're doing a good job here in the iris pen starting to get around a lot more and good girl for potty good girl he's a good girl not perfect but definitely off to a good start they're also doing a good job learning how to drink from the lick bottle that's something new we're teaching we're gonna teach them to drink out of both but thought we'd try this because they love to play and their water frequently gets tipped over so let's see what can I tell you they are all long coats in case you're just tuning in <laughs> Um, let me open the gate here. And I do have this pen upside down on purpose. I tend to do this. That way I can open the gate and mama can hop in and out throughout the day. And for a short time, the puppies are contained <laughs> until they learn to hop over as well, which one or two have already learned how. These uh, black and white boys seem to be the adventurers. Pretty soon, maybe even today, we'll start letting them out and um, they'll use our other, learn to use the other litter box, but too much freedom too soon can interfere with our potty training, so I try not to give them too much freedom too soon. Um, So this is a girl right here, and that's a girl, the one with the darkest face, the thinnest little blaze. And then we have three boys, oh, and there he goes. <laughs> He's the adventurer. He's been hopping in and out. So just stand there during my video. <laughs> He's like, oh no, I am free. <laughs> so there he goes. Off to play. <laughs> I'm going to move this bed away. Okay, I moved the bed away. Just to make it a tiny bit more challenging for them to get out. <laughs> it might buy me a few seconds. Oh, not for him. <laughs> Hey, hey, you adventurer. <laughs> so let's see, since we have two black and white boys, um, let's see, he has the darker face, so I'll call him, I should call him the adventurer. Um, I'll call him black with white, no, black with the darker face. <laughs> I guess that's what I'll call him, because his brother is over there and he has a lot more white on his face Let's see. <laughs> oh here comes the brother let's see he's gonna chase him I do think this little girl is going to lighten up quite a bit. I think she's going to be very light. <laughs> Hi. Hi. I have the other dogs out of the room for recording purposes, but don't worry. The mom is still around. <laughs> I had somebody concerned the other day. We don't force our moms to stay in the pens. They have the freedom to come and go. Most of the time, we have to close it sometimes when we are not available to supervise. <laughs> Did you bonk your head? <laughs> you 
little guy is just having a good old time. Here, come over here so I can see you. So I do think we're going to have um, extra puppies available. Um, even if you have not placed a deposit, there's a possibility. Uh, basically, available puppies are first offered to those who have placed a deposit. And we don't require deposits, but we do accept them if we have an approved puppy application on file for you. And we do have six puppies. We have Pumpkin's puppy, which I'll show you in a minute. He is... Oops, <laughs> two and a half weeks younger. He's not moving around like this yet. <laughs> here, come here. Come back in there. <laughs> for those on our deposit list, hoping for a puppy from this batch, I have an email that I will be sending you this morning. By the time you see this video, it should be sent already, hopefully. If you're interested in a future puppy, the first step in pursuing one is to submit a puppy application through our website, and I'll put the link below. So this is getting to be the fun stage where they're getting active and playful and we can start seeing little glimpses of their temperament. <laughs> we definitely know that little boy there is the adventurer and maybe the most outgoing. Looks like he'd be a good candidate for someone with other puppies or uh, maybe, you know, outgoing active people <laughs> right is that what you're thinking <laughs> good boy for potty good boy good boy for potty <laughs> hi little girl hi a little boy little boy little girl little girl Hi, little girl. And little boy. And here's Pumpkin's chunky boy. He's the only one, no one else to share milk with, so he's growing very well. <laughs> and we are giving him time to play with the big kids or to be stimulated. He's not really playing yet, and they're tugging on his ear and everything, and you know, we supervise, but it's really important for him to have that stimulation because he doesn't have any litter mates to stimulate him. So we don't leave him in here unsupervised. So don't worry about that. Starting to be a little more aware of what's going on. He's a lot younger. I mean, two and a half weeks might not seem like that much younger, but he's basically half the age of his litter mates, or, you know, his <laughs> fake litter mates. Um, so he's just. He's just young, and they don't really move around much at this age, but he will. He's starting to move around, and you'll see him be more active in the near future. He's actually going to be three weeks tomorrow.
If you like our videos, be sure to hit the like button and subscribe. And hit the bell to receive notifications when we post new videos. Stay tuned for more puppy adventures.